have everything hooked up and like that and now we have to look at the speed sensor we want to see at least one AC voltage from the speed sensor to the speed controller we start to measure the speed controller speed sensor signal while we are cranking and remember it's a AC volts not DC volts there we have around 2 volts that is really good if you don't have it, we move to the speed sensor itself and measure there. You can see I have 113 millivolts. That's not enough, and it was broken connector. I fixed that, and I have 2.6 or so, and that is very good. There's many reason why sensor can't go bad can be grinded on the end, screw too far, can be all kinds of dirt on it and all the application.